Yo, what's up, everyone? Imperdar here, and welcome to new Let's Do the Tank with Imperdar. Uh, yeah, well, let's say there is now new updates which I would like to show you, and I will. But uh, before that, let's discuss a little things that have changed well before on the game house you were able to have encounter mode which was if you were single not married you were able to encounter with another gender and go for a fight well this has changed. The encounter mode has completely taken out. It's no longer anywhere, which is pretty sad. I I never used the encounter mode because I was al already married. But anyway, that was taken out and I'm pretty sad about it. Uh, what else? Oh yeah, let's look up the armory. Here is some quick changes. The fern, I have no idea what that stands for. Maybe furniture? Maybe. But all the not very useful things have been put here. Like, the potential is now here. And you can cast gold here as well, and uh, refine, like refine item, you can do it here only. And you can do the spirit upgrading only here. This is, well, I'm not saying is it bad or good, but I knew this was coming, because it was a w new update on DDNK 2. I don't know what part, but it doesn't really matter. <laughs> and yeah, as you can see on the right, there is new icons, like they must do, like in my previous video, must do this not very useful, not necessary at all. This is something that you do not must do. <laughs> You don't basically do anything with this. The F events, well, this is, this will be out very soon, so don't expect to see this anytime soon. Basically, what you have to do, you just have to buy these uh, advanced pieces to smelt one Maya snake wand. And it's pretty okay, I guess, but I don't never seen it anywhere, so anyone would have used it. And it's not that necessary, though. It's not very good, to my opinion. The travel farm hasn't changed at all. <laughs> this is something you don't really need to do, but <laughs> you can flip one card, at least one coin. That's something that. You can at least throw out, but when you usually do it, it's not. It doesn't really give you anything. And below that is our arena. Now, how arena works? This is me, like you see, and my rank is whatever it is, and the champion is whoever it is. You can't challenge anybody. Well only these are the persons you can challenge uh, one time as you can see the number is lower than mine so they're on the ranking they're higher than me so <laughs> if you challenge them and you win you take their place and uh, it adds a new competitioner and you will be able to challenge that person 
right now the ranking only will increase one, uh, 10 numbers because it's only 1000 so it doesn't really take long to reach the 1 or 100 you can also buy new buy challenges but that's nothing you you know you don't need but I will just show you quickly how the challenge mode works well it uh, it works just like the normal sport fights but you're not fighting uh, head on against anybody so basically you're fighting against a computer this is something that is really ridiculous if you're fighting on a <laughs> map that is seriously annoying except this one isn't such a bad <clears throat> you're able to fight against no that's that's too much yeah that's too much you'll be fighting against the computer they hit every single time no matter where they are no matter what com the environment is they always hit of course the environment changes when the, the ground is destroyed but like here come on stop yeah the the one you're challenged isn't playing against you the person that who's controlling that character isn't fighting you you it is a computer I have to say it's stupid and it's really annoying if you get a very annoying map it's seriously very stupid but like this low level low power they are pretty easy to defeat once you have completed the uh, one arena fight you have to wait 10 minutes so that you will be able to challenge again you can also clear the waiting for spending 200 coins but that's nothing that you need to do alright now this one is something that is uh, <laughs> this is pretty weird actually <laughs> so how this works players can join free escort event three times a day the more advanced escort car you summon the better rewards you receive and the faster you move players can get double rewards if they join the escort event from from 1 a.m. to 2 a.m. players cannot leave the scene during the escort if they fail to reach the destination before the countdown ends escort fails players can efficiently use skills stealth leap and purify to dodge obstacles and clear B buffs the first four players reaching the destination will receive bones so uh, you'll be fighting against five people and they're real players I have to say uh, you can change the escort car by uh, using again coins but this is something that you don't need I don't know what the hell you're doing with prestige I haven't I don't know uh, any of this Valor pills is very okay but it needs to be you have to be first to get a lot of Valor pills and it's this is something you don't need uh, yeah let's I'll show you how quickly the love trip love to double seventh works you and you don't need those at all it's not necessary <laughs> so you can change you can use coins to use the purify stealth and leap and I'm on the right here and that blue thing is going to make me slow and that's that's so stupid you can use coins to clear declaration effect but right now uh, I'm not planning on winning this because 
seriously, this is something you don't need to win. With leap, you can uh, bypass traps and monsters. This is very good, but it costs 95 coins. With stealth, you can avoid uh, monsters and traps like those gulus over there, and they take time to bypass. And uh, if you have the balloon aura on you, the declaration, you can purify it by spending coins as well. But I am not going to use coins on this trip. I'll face whatever it will come and we'll see what happens. And those question marks, they have a different kind of effect. Like there, it triggered stealth. And there is the escort time. That's the time you need to get to the other side. But you don't need 8, 28 minutes to get there. <laughs> uh, the stuff will be replenished before I can reach the blue era. I hope. Yeah, it didn't. God damn it. Uh, it doesn't matter. I'm not really <laughs> interested in winning this because you don't really get anything except the prestige and some vel spirit pills <laughs> it's too bad that the encounter mode was taken out because there was the one challenge oh and that red one right here acceleration storm it lasts only 10 seconds but in increases your speed by 30 percent by here I'll be able to still pass this player because he has the declaration which lasts 30 seconds that's a lot of that that's a lot of time but we are tied but he will go over me because I'm going to have declaration and I'm not going to use coins the declaration frost is pretty bad because it reduces speed by 50% I'm not gonna use a purify to purify it because I'm not I don't want to win this game. It's it's not necessary. And here we are tied, but I think yeah I'm going to still going over him because there's gonna be that one monster and I he isn't one of those coin users like I am. I used a couple of times coins already just to win this and I say it's not worth it it's not worthy at all the, I don't know what you do with prestige but with spirit pills you can do something basically this is just straightforward just waiting pretty boring I have to say but you just have to be lucky if you get zero you get only the prestige that you were uh, with the normal escort you will get it but if you had 10% you get a little bit more 20% you get a little bit more I actually haven't challenged this guy yet I guess you you need use those power those items to fight this guy Yeah. Interesting. I never uh, done this before. No oh, one one shot kill. What? Your pain shiny green buff gain one experience. What the? Okay. Nice. Uh all right. Again, right? Come on, it's twice in a row. I'm not gonna use coins. It's it's ridic It's stupid to use coins to win this game. If I'm gonna lose, then I'm gonna lose. It's the end of that. Some players are more.
more lucky than me but no can do they're probably already won doesn't matter here they explains the same thing Oh, I might even catch on that one guy. Maybe. Probably not. The acceleration isn't that very good. But it still gives me great boost. Uh, I won't be able to catch him. Because the still lasts 30 seconds. It's a lot of, it's a lot of time. Yeah, I was last. Yeah. No worries. I don't really wanted to win this game either. Leap. It triggered leap at the end. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. So, as you see, I lost. <coughs> I got only 90 prestige and 20 spirit pills. No. Uh yeah. Since I already done that three times, you need to spend coins to do it again. Yeah, which I'm not gonna do. Definitely not. Something you don't seriously need. Alright. In the backpack there is some changes. As you saw my level is now fifty one and in my previous video the 51 wasn't here at all it was only here so this is something that was brought back but as you see the pearl right here is now gone but it's up here and here is no organize item refine or backpack lock the code is right here the organize is already here you don't it doesn't ask you do you want to do it you just do it but in Liga backpack you must do it you must confirm it mm. no big changes here except this one pearl yeah what else I can do what else I can show yeah, if you want to apply it, you can just apply it, but that's that. Open. Yeah, like this, you can open them continuously. That's o that's nice. And here, you can see the batch. How many you want to open at one time. I can open all the card boxes at one click. Now, this is very good. If you don't have to remove lay, just wait eternity to just pass by the constantly isn't bad but if you have like 999 random card boxes like I usually do it takes quite a time to open them all but with the patch it's it's easier this way hmm yeah there's still one more thing that I haven't showed yet at the boat yard. Let's have a new chamber so I could show you. I I might do it later, but right not now. There's the event is instance, pirate land and the pirate ship. Now, uh, you can enter the pirate land every single day and uh, the pirate ship you need tickets the tickets you must uh, must be bought by coins surprise there and the world cup well I don't know about this I never I don't know I don't know like you see here this is pretty uh, nice actually 
uh, and these are pretty pretty nice as well because the offensive and those increases but the rewards here are pretty pretty straightforward but I don't know how that works I never I never tried it at the pirate land there's only a couple things <laughs> these but <laughs> it depends on how far you get the pirate ship I don't know about this you need tickets I wish I could uh, complete this one because it's seriously a very great fight but uh, nobody wants to do this because they know how we're going to fail but it, you need a lot of power to complete this one I was almost able to do it but not enough yeah that's about that uh, thank you for watching and uh, I hope I'll find more updates and more playable things but in meantime stay awesome and peace out